to do much with those smokes but Hoylord might have a uh, big job on his hands now if he catches this glimpse of this train of terrorists just about waiting for him on the other side of double doors the flash is going to go over Hoylord manages to counter it with his own flash and oh Hoylord is going to have shooting practice is he yep he's going to pop out too from Hoylord Rubinho as well wow good stuff from the CTs but it's what you'd expect against an eco Hoylord with the four man it was against an eco but it was impressive nonetheless and he picks up an orb for his uh MMA started off the series wanting to be ultra aggressive. Wasn't quite able to Ooh. pull it off. Oh, and wow, here we go. Auto Tower is actually to deflect the Siege there. He's got more Marines, but look at the splash damage from oh. the Siege tanks. Oh my goodness, that is huge. The tanks, though, are unseaged. They do a little bit more DPS that way, and he is going to be able to clear this defensive line of Cassia Castilla. 89 supply versus 71 of MMA. Another Siege tank oh. on the high ground. I think this might be a little bit too much for MMA to handle right now, but he's going to be sieging up himself. And all these Marines from Cast, they're going to be forfeit as well. 60, uh, 64 supply versus 80. But MMA, he's making ground, but that's because Cass, in the meantime, just got auto turret drop inside uh, MMA's base as well, which is why the work account still shows a 12 supply lead for Cass. Yeah, he didn't actually kill any work with that, I don't believe. Uh, but of course, you know, he done infrastructure damage, he killed the units with that. And, you know, it was and the reinforcing units were pulled back into the base as opposed to supporting the army. I think that was the big thing. Yeah, that's a, that's a really big thing to point out there as well. I <laughs> Oh, here we go. Mag blinks in. There's a Doom. Maledict onto Mag. There's Jeeva's guard as well. Silent finding no tail. No overgrowth for you. Hani going to be the second to fall after. And there's the Death Ward. Nice placement from Fly, but it just won't be enough. Glimpse back. Not enough damage. There's the blink from no tail. Getting the overgrowth. Glaives dishing out damage. Trixie, very nice burrow strike. This might be a big fight for Fnatic. Hani did buy back in the end. Grave onto Vanscore. Mag on the retreat. Resolution, Cold Snap onto No-Tail, catching him out. Down he goes, Trixie falls as well. Godlike triple kill for Slark, who is just running rampant here. Glimpse back, Ooh, Remnant, Remnant jumping Remnant. around. I don't know where Hani's gone. He's Ooh. over here somewhere. <laughs> He's running away, but GG has been called by Trixie. Really? Oh my god. Oh, and that's it, the bombs down, but Nico quickly goes to get it. It's a 1v1. Nico versus Robino. And um, Robino is at short. There's only 15 seconds left on the clock. Nico does have to run very carefully. Will he go to make a kill? Oh! Pulls out his flash at the worst timing. And Arch, I believe that was a smoke. I apologize for that. And then Nico's going to go for the kill. Can he get it? Oh! oh! Fantastic headshot. Long, so it looks like they're going to just go Geranimo and try and take this A bomb site. Here goes nothing. Fingers crossed for Team Kyanite. Fingers crossed for Team Game Pub. Are they going to be able to make it 6-3? The flashes are lobbed over. Oh. The smokes are lobbed over. They've dropped down into CT spawn. And oh, the CTs are in for the fright of nice. their life. Nico with one. Couldn't get the second. Asta starting to maybe redeem himself for some of the poor Counter-Strike. Three man from ASDF. Is the four man going to happen? The battle of the Orpers. YNK versus ASDF making his way towards lowers and hearts they're going for that mid to be push again it seems bank so let's see whether they can finally get their 10th round on the board the flashes are going over ct spawn has been smoked and that normally calls the comments of a b rush kenny s finally i think he heard me he's got that headshot onto rmn hearts missing a crucial shot kill dream on 48 hp Ooh. kill dream saving the day is he gonna save the day is his 5-7 gonna save the day he's trying to play for time but I th oh no, Emotion comes in. Kiyoshima finally takes down Kill Dream. Emotion showing his emotion to win this game at oh! the moment. The one shot onto Kenny S. Emotion doing to Kenny S what Kenny S is known worldwide for and giving him a taste of his own med. Follow goes down. The bunker now being targeted down by four Ooh. of those drones. It's not going to be enough to finish it off, or is it? There we go. Manages to kill it off. Actually, no cancel on that. Ooh, and he did get a drone there. Uh, there is another STV, of course, it does start the next bunker, and another STV here to, to back it up. The spine crawler does get killed off. More STVs are coming in total. How many does he have? Is it six? Yes, yeah, six. So this is a lot of extra DPS and buffer in there. The Marines pulling backwards to try and pick up whatever they can. And Snoot's going all out here, running yep. all the way out, trying to pick them off, and he does get a decent round. Will he be able to clean up all the Marines for us? Well, back in the base, we've got the Queen coming out as well, and that's going to be the range attack necessarily. Try and pick off the SCV building this bunker. He does manage to do so, but there are four more SCVs. Great zone out there by the drones is it going to be enough the marines at the ramp at the natural expansion oh, the trying their best the scvs now they finish the bunker but can the marines even get to it the queen they're trying to defend a couple more zerglings are gone marines are going to get in and i think 
I think this might end up being the beginning of the end here. I, he he needs to be able to break out. There are still three SCVs. They can repair the bunker. That's the problem right now. Without those SCVs, Snoop might be able to get enough Zerglings to just try and rush out and kill it off. Albeit, he would take a lot of losses. But right now, the bunker can be repaired. There's no Baneling Nest. There's no gas being taken from the Zerg player. And uh, I, I think this is looking pretty dire, unfortunately, for uh, game number one. It really is. There are a lot of units trying to get this bunker. The SCVs are repairing, they're repairing each other, but the GG does get called back. Hellstrom from him. Desolator. Nightmare now up onto Illidan. Sunstrike going to be launched. Brain Sap as well. Sprout to hold Ooh. him in place. Here goes the cooldown. Right. Rocket Barrage as well. Grave very Ooh. nicely timed. Down goes Yol. C Doy going to be second to fall possibly. One more. Oh, Ooh. really nicely played. Dodging through the trees. That tree and chasing him. Getting that. away from that bloody tree. And oh, that was really nice play. Because you can RP people and then go to Darkseer. Yeah. He vacuums them or drops water yeah. and then vacuums them. It's <laughs> it's disgusting the amount of damage you can do. We stomped him back in. Uh, there's, a, I think, an arrow landed on Ember Spirit. Lich, oh, we'll ping around like crazy. But it got Doesn't interrupted. Catch, yeah. It got interrupted. They're going to catch the... Oh, who is that? Dark Seer? So teeny tiny. I could barely see who he is. Dark and now they're going to chase down, down the Crystal Mage. He's died a lot. Oh, the Weaver! Big time lapse there. That time lapse. He was dead. I thought I saw the... Hookshot. Lovely hookshot hook on that Storm Spirit. That was a oh, maximum range that, hook shot. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Look at the Ember Spirit. Is like he will chase all day long. And he's you are going down, Miranda. Slide of this. Down goes Miranda. Weaver's going to tank a couple of these tower shots. Uh, I've got to know down the time of that hook shot. That was... Live. That was like 18 minutes. I reckon that was 18 minutes. That was like max range, perfect hook shot, ridiculous. Nico gets taken down on short. <laughs> Boylord does get YNK, but Jesus. Oh! oh my God, shots off everywhere. And it's 2v2. Now that was a fantastic hold from the CTs of Game Pub in CT spawn, but they couldn't quite make it work from. Hoylord will be checking on that long lane. He's going to meet KGR very soon. Takes the first few shots. No hits at all. Oh, wow. 11 health. Oh, oh, my God. <laughs> Manages to nade himself. I think he was caught off on surprise right there. And at Hoylord, he's on a pistol master right now. Oh, wow. nice shot.